Egan police say a man who was firing shots into the air in the parking lot of an apartment complex is now dead. They say officers shot and killed him. It happened this afternoon in the 1200 block of Ironwood Lane. Our Nina Morney joins us live from the scene with more details. Nina. Hi, Angela. This is the Forest Ridge apartment building here in Egan. This all happened about five hours ago. There are still some uh, Egan police officers, squad cars out here, as well as the Minnesota Bureau of Criminal Apprehension investigating, trying to figure out exactly what happened here. It all started around noon. That's when Egan police told us that they got a phone call, a 911 call. Someone was telling them there was a man outside of the complex here firing multiple shots into the air in the direction of some of the buildings. Police say when they arrived, uh, there was more gunfire, an exchange of gunfire between that man and officers. No officers were hurt. That man did die here on the scene. They didn't say today yet who fired first in that exchange. Neighbors out here told us they heard the gunshots, weren't sure what it was, and they were just too afraid to even go outside. When we saw a cop pulled in over here, I mean, sirens blasting, going fast and everything, I'm like, if it's for that banging, popping noise, that was right over here. So again, just a very a scary situation for neighbors out here and still a lot of questions. Uh, to give you perspective, there hasn't been an officer involved shooting that ended with a person, a suspect, dying here in Egan since 1992. Police are not yet releasing uh, this suspect, this man's name, and we are looking forward to hearing uh, who exactly that man is. He will be, uh, that information rather, will be released by the medical examiner. And Nina, any idea why this man, why he was firing his gun in the first place? There isn't, Angela. We don't know at this point why this man, uh, they say, was out here firing his gun. But police did tell us today that it's very fortunate that nobody else, no passersby, and no other officers were hurt. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, Nina.